Hey everybody and welcome to Leia's Lair. In today's episode, we'll be going over 9 things we learned today about Star Wars Galaxy's Edge. If you're enjoying the videos, please give them a like, share, and subscribe to the channel so I can continue making them for you. Number 1. Force ghosts will be present and you might not be able to see them. The Force is a very mysterious thing, and sometimes maybe Jedi from the past can visit us and be part of your experience. That means exactly what you think it does, and not every character that we hear is a character that we see. Number 2. They created a new planet to optimize the experience. The new land will be based on a yet-to-be-seen planet named Batu, where the central focus is a place called Black Spire Outpost. While the land itself may be new to fans, as an outpost for smugglers, rogues, and scoundrels, it will be popping with some of our old favorites. Number 3. You can pilot the Millennium Falcon. Millennium Falcon Smuggler's Run will give us our long-awaited chance to fly the Falcon in all her glory. However, if flying's not your thing, you'll have the option to either be a gunner, fending off foes, or an engineer, making sure the ship stays in the air. Number 4. There'll be lots of places to eat and drink. Disney announced that they've teamed up with Coca-Cola to bring some truly amazing products that will only be available in the Galaxy's Edge section of the park. Other more adult drinks will also be available at Ogus Cantina. Not thirsty? There'll be many cool food options available as well. Check out my other video for more of a breakdown. Number 5. The voices you hear will be the original actors. When you hear the wise words of Yoda, it will in fact be brand new recordings from Frank Oz. Another deep cut but beloved favorite, Nien Nam, will also appear in the park with new dialogue courtesy of his original voice actor, Bill Kipsang Rotich, whom the Imagineers traveled all the way to Kenya to find and record. Number 6. The music will also be original. The music you hear while walking around the park will be conducted by none other than John Williams with new music created just for the park. Number 7. There will be unique merchandise hidden in the shops. And if you want them, you're gonna have to work for them. That might even mean bartering with the shop owner to get them. Number 8. Rise of the Resistance. This ride was designed with one goal in mind, and that is to escape. You will be captured resistant members trying to escape a First Order Star Destroyer. If you're lucky, you might get to see Kylo, Rey, Finn, or Poe too. That sounds pretty fun to me. Number 9. If you want a lightsaber, you'll have to build it. Yes, you'll be able to own your very own lightsaber. The catch is you can't just buy it, you'll have to build it. It is meant to be an intimate, individual experience, which will give you a saber that is truly one of a kind. This is probably what I'm looking forward to the most. And there you have it. Thanks for watching, everyone. What are you looking forward to the most at Star Wars Galaxy's Edge? Let me know down below in the comment section. And remember to like, share, and subscribe to the channel for more great videos to come. I hope to see you all again in Leia's Lair.